All right, quick product review on my favorite magazine, The Backwoodsman. First off, this is, um, I get this in the grocery store and um, it comes out every other month, bi-monthly. And the price is very reasonable compared to all the other magazines out there. Most of them that I see are over $7 and many of them are $10. So it's very reasonable. What I like about this, I call it a Renaissance outdoors magazine because it, it dabbles in a little bit of everything. Um, it, uh, you can, let's see here. Here's like a survival article. I, sorry, my fingers are all cut up here. Um, here's another article about a guy who took a deer antler for his Mora knife and made a handle out of it. Really cool. There's always cooking articles, usually with like cast iron skillets and things like that that are basically uh, old school cooking. Uh, what else? What else? What else? I marked a couple articles. And here's one on tea. I've never seen anything like it. Here's a survival article, surviving a blizzard up north. And what else? And here's a historical firearm article. So there's always firearm articles in this as well. Now, not all just historical. Sometimes there, there's a couple in here about... Um, uh, small arms, 22 um, rimfire. Here's how to make an emergency uh, stove out of a Coca-Cola can. So it's just really diverse. Uh, the pros of flint and steel over um, other fire starting components like a ferro rod. And it's just a really, really diverse, eclectic magazine. It can cater to the fishermen, to the gardener, to the weekend warrior, um, outdoorsman, hunter, prepper, you name it. Really good magazine. Um, check it out. Oh, and the uh, website is backwoodsmanman, I believe, dot com. But I'll put it in the notes section. All right. Thanks for watching.